BBL Drizzy. I ain't know this was an entire challenge that's been created by Metro Boomin. Like, I'm just catching up on all of this right now. Because I'm going to be honest with you guys. Once I start, first started hearing about these big names starting to diss each other, you know, we had like Chris Brown, J. Cole. I wasn't really paying attention to it. I automatically think it's fake beef. Like, it's not really not like that. They're doing it for some streams or whatever. But I'm not going to lie. Metro Boom was definitely throwing some shots on Twitter. Freaky ass nigga. <laughs> Freaky ass nigga, you was thinking I got. That's crazy. His song is in my head. But yeah, look, Drake, I'm not gonna lie. You, you're, not, you're not looking too good in this photo right here. I don't know what type of fruit cup type of shit is this. But yeah, nah. And then he even exposed him for painting his nails. He says, I know a nigga pushing 40 and painting his, his nails, not trying to call me lame. Now, this is from a week or so ago. I see one of you guys that commented down below talking about how there was a BBL challenge that's been created. Metro Boomin created a beat. And said that the person that basically makes the best diss track over this beat gets like $10,000 and a free beat. So now this is the second challenge that's basically going viral on the internet. Dissing Drake and dancing to a song of one of his ops. It's tough. So what we're going to do in this video right here, we're going to give a listen to some of the competitors for this BBL, BBL Drizzy Drake giveaway. Comment down below, do you think Drake actually got a BBL? I need to look into that. Oh, you see this blow up as BBL Drizzy. I said if you read it, this is too late. About to give more life to a nigga, better thank me later for the shit that I'm about to go see. And your head and your underage left over, trick the chub, that nigga trying to clear his plate. Nigga, drop four, this is in a motherfucking day. Memes, all you gotta say, nigga, what the hell? What the hell? Don't hit that red button, I'm scared, man. Hit the red button, I'ma dance some. Leave a nigga flying in the air. Bro, trying to chase some, ain't gonna wreck none. Doc, you don't cut it like a test dummy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, it was alright. It was alright. You know what I'm saying? He's 17 years old. He's working on his craft, but for a 17 year old, I guess, you know, it's pretty good. Let's hop over to TikTok because we already know TikTok is where we find all the BBL Drizzy challenges and any challenge that you want to find, you'll find them on TikTok. So this is these are these are them right here. It's for a violin. <laughs> Bro. It's almost said not the classical diss. Drake is over here getting dissed in every genre possible. With challenges, songs, beats, disses, violins. <laughs> Man getting this by Unk now. You already look it. You already know he be wearing the open toe sandals at the barbecues. You already know it. And he probably be throwing down on the grill too. You look look at him. That's Unk right there. He's singing every tune at the at the cookout, bro. This is tough, bro. I don't think there's a coming back for Drake. Damn. That was tough. Okay, she came in a different. Coming at his whole entire character, bruh. Yeah, I, I was just thinking about it. I don't think there's really any coming back for Drake at this point. He can't collab with any other top artists in the industry. If he is going to collab with anyone, it's going to have to be someone that's just coming into the industry. And he rarely ever does that either. So, bruh, do you think there's a comeback for Drake? Comment down below because these 
trends are definitely hitting his heart. Man's just got religiously violated. Oh, nah. Carl Winslow joins the BBL Dream Challenge. I'm some shooting for stars. Your baby mama know me simply as Carl. You probably know me as I'm going too far. Like academics, I'm just kidding with bars. Assume the position I know that you do. The Diddy effect is coming for you. Stay in your house. That is the same booth. The weekends are over. The weekends are too. You're thinking you're safe because you ride with straps. Your homies are yes, man. They lie in cap. Exposed from the beat while you cry. In fact, I'm hearing you now like. We know that you do. I'm coming for Dan and I'm coming for you. You're right about one thing, it might not be true. So show us the proof. Are you loving the crew? You know, that, that was that was a good one. He has some bars in there. I'm not going to lie, but hearing these different ones definitely exposes the fact that these top artists, they definitely do have talent to them. Yo, All right, let's hear what he has BBL, that's your funny like Dee Chappelle. None of these artists won't have enough of the bars. Till they're going to sleep in jail. I'm talking about you with both your earrings. We know it's not C Chanel. If I want to talk Drake with a little girl, how about that other Drake? Does it ring a bell? No Josh and to get it popping and do it proper. Cause I'm a father with two daughters. I'ma come and drag your ass like Ru Paul would. Y'all never ball, you just some blue ballers. Don't act like you don't know me. It's not fact if it isn't proven. These kids influence when they take the music. But I let the dog love it stick to grooming. Even if these rappers have bars, the girls that they with can't get into them. All that for Amanda shows some little kids gonna sick like Danny on Nick producing. Yo. Nah, he was fast on that one. Bonkers, bro. Everyone coming for Drake. How did we get here? Can't believe they are talking about you like this. Might be criminal the way Metro puts you with this. I ain't ashamed to say I miss the college days, Drizzy. The best I ever had, we was rocking young money. But something changed over the years. Was it all the fame? Started with Wayne. Now it's BBL beside the name. <laughs> oh, nah. Boy, you oh, insane. man. Get back to singing about coming through and the furthest thing. And nothing was the same as my favorite album, too. Like, now we out here dancing to this. It was a banger. Nothing was the same. It was a banger. A lot of Drake's album, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not gonna lie, I would say I stopped playing Drake's albums after 2021. I stopped playing them religiously. Maybe that's because I got closer with God. But everything up, like Scorpion was a banger. Everything before Scorpion was a banger. And then even when the, with the uh, album that has, I think it's like Demo Lane tapes or something like that. But, bruh. Everyone and their mom is going after Drake. There, I, there's no recovery because once it gets to the minds of the people, bro, I don't the think there's any coming back. I can't hear you. Shorty, you're mute. I can't hear you. My half will probably die. Let me see. Yeah. Got the girls going wild. Even your child, even your child. If you can't see it, then you know you in the now. You in the now. You in the now. Baby, I'm busy. Got the girls going wild. Even your child, even your child. If you can't see it, then you know you in the now. You in the now. Trust me. That's him singing this? Kids got you so in love. How you got a full beard and singing this right here? I don't know.
Yo. Yo. El BBL. It's on Spotify. It's on. Damn, every musician on this joint. But you gotta have some big lungs for that. Like, your lung control needs to be crazy. You guys need to comment down below which one out of all the people we watch you think is the best, have the best challenge. Hey. I'm not gonna lie, he killed that. But another thing, no one's really doing the challenge. They, I think he was supposed, they were supposed to rap over it. Right, let's see. Nah, nah, you're cut, you're cut. Ain't, ain't no way, you're cut. I'm sorry. Your hips are moving just a little too loose. The back was arching just a little too much. Ah, gotta go, gotta go. Oh, that was about to be tough. Oh, never mind. I did the hashtag. I don't know how I'm just coming across this, bro. He might, he might be one of the winners. Oh, no, nah, he's nice. He's nice. That was tough. What it's seeming like, we have a lot of different people doing the challenge, but no one's getting vocal with it. I don't think anyone wants to vocally diss Drake. I don't know. That's what it's seeming like. But I think he, I think he's definitely top three out of everyone we saw so far. My fault. It's oh, been a hell of a... Why did I really look like Metro Boomin? Yo, Metro, go make some drums, bitch. Yo! No, I bet. Matter of fact, it's ready right now. Oh no, you made a beat, bro. What? Oh, 
I no, but I do every time I'm gonna cook up the best. Yo, Metro. Hey, yo! Not BBO Drizzy in the flesh. Who that? Who that? Who's buying that? I'm not gonna lie, if you buy that, you're canceled. I don't care. Okay, we might actually get a good one. Come on now. I have faith. Come on, man. Look, Drake, you gotta do better. Too bad them BBS can't enhance your character. Now they put in a barrier, say you fucking with kids. Man, you better go ghost. They say a ghost on your pen. I know you say K Dot was weak as fuck, but K Dot went in. And if you did some again, Drake, you just might end. Damn. Don't act like you don't know. You was trying to wake this man up, and now this man woke. Drake, you better go. I know it hurt your soul, but man, just give it up, sit back and play your role, goddamn. It can only get worse. <laughs> it can only get worse, Drake. Look, it can only get worse. Ugh. Man, I know that you hurt. <laughs> he got it. He got it. Anyone that's rapping, I would say he definitely got the top spot for the rappers in this challenge. So far that I've seen. Damn, you over here slopping up the sacks. Damn, Sidon, chill. Holy shucks. And Drake, the way this remix is stuck in my head, okay. <laughs> we, in, we in the Latin culture too now? Oh, man. I'm gonna do my stuff. Why you trolling like a bitch? Ain't you tired? Trying to strike a chord, and it's probably a minor. That was tough. So Metro Boomin dropped this beat. All right, it was like, like a verse. Everyone's here for the free beat. I'm here for shits and giggles and fun. So here's my verse. Right, it's hear, very hear, bad, but it's very silly, goofy. Um, BBL Drizzy B and Aubrey stands for bitch. Stop worrying about Smino and start worrying about your kids, or at least the ones you groom, cause they're barely even teens. No, to Millie Bobby Brown, you definitely did some Stranger Things, but that's cool. Okay, bars. Ass. Make it clap, make it fast, shut your BBL ass up and make some raps. You can call your writers, they'll appear just like your abs. Damn. You're a bitch, you're a bitch. We don't fucking like you. Fuck you, Canada can have you back. I oh my gosh, the whole culture done turned on him. It's official, Drake is completely cooked. I don't know what he's gonna do this year. I don't know how he's gonna possibly come back. Comment down below if you have any good ideas for Drake at this point. If all the allegations against him are true about him being a little pervy perv with the younger people, which I wouldn't be surprised of, then he probably doesn't deserve to come back. But hey, I'm no judge, you feel what I'm saying? Make sure you do smash the like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications. I'm going to catch you guys in the next one. The same way you're going to catch me in the next one. Peace.